Hey guys, Ryu here with another video for Blender. In this one, I'm going to be talking about symmetry. I'm going to show you really quick ways of symmetrizing in Blender with Mesh Machine and Hard Ops. I'm also going to show you how to do it with Vanilla Blender because some people don't know about it. So when you add a cube, right, just add a cube, we're going to go to Edit Mode and grab this vert and Shift Control B to bevel this a bit. And then we wanted to symmetrize it to the other side. So you're not mirroring it, you're actually symmetrizing the physical geo. So now to do this in Vanilla Blender, you need to select everything with A. And then go to Mesh and Symmetrize, if I can find it here. And then you need to determine which axis. So in this case, it's going to be from minus X to X, okay? So you need to select the correct axis. And the problem here is that if you want to symmetrize on multiple axes, you're going to have to do it again. So deselect, select, go to mesh, you know, symmetrize, yeah. It's a lot of steps, you know, you might die during the process, okay. So I'm going to show you how to do it much quicker. It's going to be from Z to minus Z, you see what I mean? It just takes time. Now I'm going to go back and if you want to do this really quickly, I mean, the quickest way of uh, symmetrizing in Blender is going to be with Mesh Machine. I mean, it's really quick. It's that quick, okay that's done on all axes you know what i mean so the way it works is you press alt x which is the same shortcut as for uh, hard ops mirror which is insanely useful because you know it's a muscle memory basically so you don't have to you know add another shortcut so when you press alt x and you hold it you will see kind of like a gizmo and when you move your mouse towards the, the one of these um axis so let's say we're gonna mirror on x so you move, move your mouse to the left you can see the dot is highlighted and when you move it further and you touch it it's gonna actually mirror this okay so watch this right it's a pie menu so you don't have to click anything you simply alt x and you move your mouse okay so one more time alt x and move your mouse and boom move your mouse and boom you see what i mean to symmetrize in hard ups you need to be in solid view uh, you simply press Alt X and then you press D or you can go here to this menu and change to symmetry. So D, symmetry and uh, once you change to symmetry, it's going to stay in symmetry. Okay, so when you want to mirror on each axis, you simply have to hold shift and you click on every single of these, you know, points and right click and you're done. Okay, and uh, mirror will stay on symmetry. Okay, um, so Alt X is still going to be in symmetry. If you want to reset it, you just press X and you're done, okay? So now you're in a mirror mode, all right? So it's going to actually add a mirror modifier, right? So there you go. That's how it works in Blender with, you know, Vanilla, Mesh Machine, and Hard Ops. I'm using Mesh Machine Mirror all the time. Uh, you know, the great advantage of Mesh Machine here is that nothing has to be selected. Everything can be deselected and it still works, uh, which is, you know, amazing. This is fantastic for... Um, uh, for quick work because usually when you for example fix something uh, you know symmetry is mostly for topology right so when you fix something um fix topology then you know you don't have to go to solid mode or you don't have to you know deal with all this malarkey here you don't have to select everything you just simply mirror and uh, you know uh, and you're done so it's really quick okay guys that's it for this one there is a link to hard ups and box cutter as well as machine add-ons in the video descriptions, if you don't have them, grab them. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.